Hello guys, welcome back to Vidich Academy. This is Mayuri and we are going to discuss an important concept under the straight line that is the parametric equations of a line L. So we are already familiar with the symmetric form of a line equation which is x minus x1 divided by cos theta is equal to y minus y1 divided by sin theta. And now let us equate this value with r. So that implies from this equation we get x minus x1 is equal to r cos theta and y minus y1 will be equal to r sin theta. And then by squaring on both the sides we get x minus x1 whole square is equal to r square cos square theta. And similarly here we get y minus y1 whole square is equal to r square sin square theta. And now let us add both these terms. So we get x minus x1 whole square plus of y minus y1 whole square is equal to r square cos square theta plus r square sin square theta. And then from both these terms we can take r square as the common factor into the remaining term will be cos square theta plus sin square theta that is 1. So here we get r square as the value of x minus x1 square plus y minus y1 square. So that implies we get the value of r which will be equal to under root x minus x1 square plus y minus y1 whole square. So this is nothing but the formula of distance. So here mod r denotes the distance of a point p x1 comma y1 from the point Q x comma y on the same straight line L. So here the variable r is a real number and is called a parameter. So therefore we can see that a point P x comma y on the line L there exists r such that x will be equal to x1 plus r cos theta and the coordinate y will be equal to y1 plus r sin theta. So these are the coordinates of point P and are called the parametric equations of a straight line L. And now let us discuss an example. So here we need to write the parametric equations of a straight line passing through the point 3 comma 2 and making an angle 135 degrees with the positive x axis. So let us use this equation. So we get x equal to x1 that is 3 plus of r into cos 135 degrees that is minus 1 by root 2. So that implies we get 3 minus r by root 2 as the value of x. And similarly the value of y will be equal to 2 plus r into sine 135 which is 1 by root 2. So that implies we get here 2 plus of r by root 2 as the value of y. So these are the parametric equations of a given straight line. Hope you understood the concept. For more videos visit our website Vidich Academy. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.